In William Edmondson Park in Nashville, you'll find plenty of trees, but there is one in particular with a special purpose. Its name is Jillian's tree in honor of Belmont freshman Jillian Ludwig. She was shot and killed while out for a walk. News 2's My Owens has a first look at this new memorial ahead of the dedication ceremony tomorrow. In cemeteries, historically, trees have been for generations used as memorial markers. While this is far from a cemetery, the feeling you get when you walk around this park is one you can't quite shake. It's a long lasting tree, it's majestic, and, and it has symbolic value. But this one is unlike any other. There are certain species that are used quite often and bald cypress is one of them. So when we were trying to decide what would be an appropriate tree to honor Jillian with, that just came up in our research. Create a living legacy to Jillian. This is Jillian's tree, named after Jillian Ludwig, the freshman Belmont student who was walking in this very park when she was hit and killed by a stray bullet. After uh, that bullet hit Miss Jillian, I mean, it was like an outcry from the community. The community residents actually helped the police uh, locate the person who did it. And Jillian isn't the only honor that lives here. Just around the corner, you'll find a tree for Edge Hill residents who lost their lives to gun violence. And then a little further, you'll see one with each victim of the Covenant School shooting. We were stunned and, and just gutted by it. So, it wasn't long before we had the con we started having conversations about how do we appropriately honor Jillian. Bringing new life into this community. There needed to be a reclaiming of that space. There needed to be a blessing. There needed to be uh, 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 a way for people to understand that this is still a safe place. In front of Jillian's tree will be a plaque unveiled on Saturday along with the dedication ceremony. So as this tree grows, her memory will continue spreading for years to come. These people will always be remembered. You know, years and years from now, when that tree grow up and be a big baby, people will come through and say, that's Miss Jillian's tree. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And as you saw, we are not revealing what the plaque looks like just yet. You will be able to see it after the dedication ceremony tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. It is open to the public.